evening, Barangay La Filnes. It's day 22, Sunday, May 22. Ephesians chapter 3, verses 20 to 21. Now to him who is able to do immeasurably more than all we ask or imagine, according to his power that is at work within us, to him be glory in the church and in Christ Jesus throughout all generations, forever and ever. Amen. As the uh, Apostle Paul concludes his prayer, he shifts his focus to the one to whom he is praying. He declares that God is capable not only of answering his prayers, but also of doing more than anyone could ever imagine. Think about that for a moment. There is no prayer we can offer that is too big for God. So we can pray boldly. How will God respond to the faithful prayers of his people? Can we begin to imagine what God will do? What might God ask of us? Move the focus from yourself to him. What does God want to do? in and through you? What does he desire of our churches, educational institutions, compassionate ministry centers, pastors, and people? Remember, it is his power at work in us that our world needs. To him, be glory in the church and in in Christ Jesus throughout all generations. Ephesians 3.21 Today's prayer. Today we ask for the things that we cannot even imagine, but that you desire. We ask for a holy, loving, and unifying spirit to, to fill us. We ask for the holy boldness, courage, and wisdom. Fill us with your power and purpose. May we never forget your power, which is at work within us. What is the Holy Spirit saying to you today about the Lord's protection, direction, and revelation for your life and the life of the La Filnes Church? Good evening. Our devotion... Uh, was written by Tim Crump, District Superintendent, Southwest Indiana. Thank you. God bless you, Barangay La Filnas. See you tomorrow. Bye.